Something to tell you. What happened? I uh, peed on my face a little. How did that happen? I have a curved penis. It's unfortunate. Well, I got something to show you. Oh, what is it? Is it a dead animal? No, come here. <laughs> what is that? Take a while, I guess. Nope, I'm leaving. No, I'm just pulling your way in. Come here. Holy dead baby corpses! What is that? This, sir, this is a time machine. Oh, wow, you never told me you are building a time machine. Well, you never asked. I actually did, many times if I recall. Just gotta add my finishing touches. Are you building a time machine? Leave me the hell alone, you freak! <laughs> Well, that doesn't matter. All that matters is that we're going to use this. Alright, how do you use it? I'll show you. Show me how it works. Alright. Press this button, turn it on. Alright. On. Then, these side buttons control where you go in time. Can I press them? Yeah. Turn it on. Alright. Now I can look up porn on this computer! Whoa, where am I? Whoa! Where am I? Whoa. Whoa, are you Dumbledore from Harry Potter? No, Dumbledore's a fat prick. You see all this? You see this right here? I'm a real wizard, you see this? I'm like 100 years old, how old are you? You're like some little kid who goes to high school. I've been to high school, I've been there, I've been to college, I've been everywhere. I'm a wizard. So, what? what? Whoa, really? Can I touch your beard? No, you can't touch my beard, unless you got some horse tranquilizer, like a stick in my veins to get really high right now. No, wizard, I don't have any. Then you can march yourself back in that fruity little time machine and go back into your little plastic world with you can play with baby dolls and all the stuff that teenagers play these kind of days. I don't know what they play with. And bake cakes and live your life the way you used to instead of bothering me, where you can sit down and snuggle with your mom and dad and, you know, live your life all cute and cuddly while I sit here and I do some meth, alright? So, how about you leave? You go to your house, you go to you go to school, you live in, you go to high school. I've been to high school. I've been to college, I've been to wizard college. You don't know, you don't know anything. I don't want you here in my magical woods. It's, it's pretty amazing over here, and I don't want you ruining it. So, get out. Leave. Leave now. You hear that? That's the that's the sound of you being unwelcomed in my house. Leave. Leave this place. <laughs> Pick you this flower. I don't want your girly flower. Well, I think you have a drug problem. Well, I think you need to suck my wand. So, how about you leave? Or before I turn you into a dildo. Oh, wait, you already are. <laughs> See, I just made it up. Right on the spot. Leave. Me leave. Wizard, why don't you come back with me? I think you're a really good guy. You just need help. I think you have a drug problem. And if you come back, maybe I can give you some meth. Ooh, meth? You know, I was just kidding about that dildo thing. You're actually pretty cool. You're not dildo. You're not dildo at all. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Oh, let's go get some help. Well, here's my time machine. You just... You just step up in there, and then turn it on, and it'll take us back to the present time. Well, that kind of, that kind of sounds stupid, but 
There blows your goat. Let's get in. Come on. You turn it on. Presses some buttons. Right there, right there. Off we go. Okay, here we are. My home. Nice pad. Nice. Wizard, now I'm going to take you to see my friend Dr. Dingus. He is a very good psychologist, and I think you could greatly benefit from him. I know you're a nice man deep down. Whatever you say, man. Let's do it. Tell us we got meds. Hi, Wizard. I'm Dr. Dingus. This is my friend, Cuddles the Camel. If you don't want to talk to me, he's always got his ears open, just just say cuddles and he'll be listening. Nice to meet you, dingus. Well, Mr. Wizard, Cuddles would like to know why you started doing drugs in the first place. You tell Cuddles to lick my butt. I'm not saying nothing. Now, now. now. Come on, when is this going to be over? I'm going to leave. What's that meth you promised me? have to me? talk to Dr. Dingus. Alright, alright, alright. We have to. Mm. Cole said if you tell us why, he'll give you this big bag of crack. No, oh, crack! No, I want, no. I want some talk first. I want talk. Some. Talk. Use words. Alright. Well, I guess I started doing drugs when I was about 13 or so. About the time when my dad left my family, and I don't know, I guess I just needed something to deal with all the pain. I don't know. Maybe that's when. Okay, now we're making progress. Let me ask you another question. Have you ever had a homosexual experience? Alright, to hell with you people. I am going to do what all famous people do and get my own reality show. So, I don't need you asking me questions about my homosexual experience which I've never had, so, adieu. It's the wizard's story of redemption. and hard to make. Not proud of what I did, but, you know, I, I did it. Plus, I'm tripping balls right now. <laughs> oh, I love meds. 